Hey everybody, this is Don over at Johnny's Used Cars. Today I'm going to show you this 2004 Toyota Crown Athlete. Um, it's got just under 124,000 kilometers, which is about 77,000 miles. So let's take a look around, we'll show you the features inside. Now the Crowns are the, the cornerstone of Toyota uh, for the luxury cars. Okay, this is before the Lexus came out and everything else. Uh, they've been around here for a very, very long time. Uh, but the Crowns are a five-passenger vehicle. Or the Crown is a five-passenger vehicle in the 300 series category. That means the road tax per year is going to be 19,000 yen, which is about 175 dollars. The road tax is due every April-May time frame. Okay, so if you get this from us, we'll go ahead and take care of it for this year, and then it's on you to get it next year. All right. So let's jump inside. We'll uh, show you the features, but first, as I always like pointing out, these rain guards. So the rain guards will allow you to roll your window down a little bit, so you get that cross ventilation, especially in the summertime. That's going to help you to keep that extremely hot air out. And then obviously get a good windshield visor. All right. Here's the inside. A lot of luxury in this thing. All right. All right. So it's got a bunch of keys here. Okay. So as long as the keys on your person, foot on the brake. Push the button one time and it cranks over. Okay. 123, 772 on the odometer. Let that thing talk to you. Okay, so the blinking light, obviously your um, seatbelt light. Obviously where your seatbelt's over here, they do give tickets on and off base. Uh, that one in the middle is your emergency brake. It is a kick type. Uh, so when you, uh, I'm sorry, it does have a uh, lever that you have to pull to disengage it. And then when you kick it down, it comes back on. I'll show you that lever in a little bit. But other than that, just a straightforward, straight ahead um, um, instrument cluster. Anything pops up on your uh, on your dash, please pull over, find out what it is, and take the necessary action. You don't want to cause more damage to your vehicle, okay? Uh, off to the left here, you do have your uh, radio and monitor. This one does have a rear camera, along with some sensors, I think, I heard. Um, your air conditioning controls all right here. Radio controls and everything else over here. Um, do you have your lighter or, or compartment? Yeah, there's actually a non-smoking one. Smells like smoke, in my opinion, but we're going to uh, smoke bomb that. Uh, get that taken care of, hopefully. Um, your cup holders, your shifter. You have a couple uh, modes here, okay? And then little compartment, okay? And this is old school. Um, you're obviously not going to use that. All right, so, uh, and just real quick, uh, this is where you have to pull for the park and for the emergency brake um, to release. Let's go ahead with, um, hey, let's just go with uh, the leg space. So this seat is all the way back, all the way down. Uh, I am 5'11". I'll probably slide this up two to three inches to be comfortable. I could drive it like it here if I was like a, I don't know, back on the block, I guess, but um, being my age, I, I think I like to take it easier. So yeah, I, would, I would definitely slide this up a couple inches. Okay, um, passenger space over here. You do have your uh, your road flare back there. And then these are power seats that you can control this from over here. All right, slide up and back. Um, I'm not gonna go into all the luxuries that this thing has, because there are a lot. You, have, you do have your mirror controls over here. Um, let me see, where's that ETC? Or you got a little compartment here, come on. Very small compartment, uh, maybe put some coins in there or whatnot. I know it had an ETC reader. There's your glove box and there's the ETC. So the ETC is uh, the electronic toll collector. Um, it works like easy pass in the States uh, for the expressway, uh, but you gotta get the card for it. Uh, well, I should mention uh, you do have a little bit of storage on each side of the doors. Cup holders I showed you already. Yeah, I'm losing track today. I don't know what it is, but let's go eye level. This one, uh, I can see some of the hood, okay which is rare because most of them you can't. Go all the way back. And then we'll show you the auction sheet. We keep our auction sheets, uh, let you know that this has been in, in no accidents. It is graded number four, so a non-accident vehicle. This is also good to, not only for your peace of mind knowing it wasn't an accident, but also if you're going to sell your vehicle after a few years, if you haven't been in an accident here, then you can show that to the next uh, potential buyer. Okay, so just a few things that are different on this one. You do have your gas gas cover release down here, okay? So you push that and that'll open it. You do have a slot here. Uh, that's so you put your key. So show you there. So you slide your key in there and it just stays, okay? So we'll leave that right there. And then for your trunk release, that is on the door, okay? 
So you push that and it opens. And I'm just gonna turn this off, which is just push that button one time. And then you do have your hood release. Okay, so I'm gonna open that. And again, power uh, seats. Put a second row here. Let's go inside. Alrighty. So with the seat all the way back, all the way down, and it's you know quite reclined, I still have about an inch, inch and a half uh, between me and the back of the seat. Um, now this one does have um, vents, air conditioning vents back here, so this is gonna cool down the uh, vehicle a lot quicker. Um, you have pouches on each side. Nothing in the doors except for a, just a little bit of uh, space and storage, I don't know if you can see that. And it does have this center console where you have some controls, okay, for uh, the radio compartment in here. And then, look at that, you got your cup holders in the middle, all right? But if you have a third person, sorry. Oh, wow, look at this, I, I didn't even notice this. Let's see, and you actually got lights back here as well. All right, so let's go to the trunk area. Just a huge trunk. All right, let's go up front. We'll show you the uh, the engine. It's a really nice engine. Switch hands here. It is a V6. Really not much to show. It's pretty much like an egg. Everything's all covered. All right, so 2004 Toyota Crown Athlete. Um, 124,000 kilometers on it, which is again about 77, 78,000 miles. Um, military price 51 with the military discount additional. We could go ahead and get this down to 4,900. The 49 will include the two year JCI, the one year bumper to bumper full warranty, the 2021 road tax, and the 10% sales tax already included. Only the American insurance will be on top, and that's uh, based on your pay grade and age and whether you're going liability or full coverage. Totally up to you. If you've had no accidents in the last three years or any claims, I should say, in the last three years with your previous insurer, Please let us know. We may be able to get you a discount on the insurance policy here. Um, of course, shop around. I always recommend that. See what other places have, and then come out to Johnny's Used Cars. Let us show you what we have here. If you're out and about, you have any questions, you think you're not getting the right information, go ahead and contact us. Our contact inf information is below in the description box. If you're on your phone watching this, please click the uh, title. That'll take you to YouTube. Or if you're on our website, you can click the YouTube icon on the bottom right of the video, and that'll take you there as well. Uh, as always, we're always available to uh, assist you, regardless if you're buying a car from us or not. Uh, but thank you very much for watching. Take care. Hope to see you soon.